Hey guys, so welcome back to Reggie T Plus. So I was going through uh, social media earlier and I saw a video, um, well, before I saw the video, I saw an article about the fastest man in the world, Usain Bolt, and the fact that um, it's alleged that he has contracted um, COVID-19. Now the crazy part about it is the fact that I'm looking at Usain as one of the uh, elite individuals physically on the globe. So if someone like that, right, um, yes, he's not running anymore. Yes, he's not competing. But still, uh, I perceive from afar that this guy is one of the most healthiest individuals around as well. And he's alleged to have contracted COVID-19. Now, he put out a video um, neither confirming or denying um, that he has COVID-19. He did say, however, this. Good morning, everybody. Um, just waking up. Um, like everybody has checked social media. Saw that social media say that I'm confirmed of COVID-19. Uh, I did a test on Saturday to leave because I work. Uh, trying to be responsible, so I'm going to stay in and stay from my friends. And also, I'm um, having no symptoms, so going to quarantine myself um, and wait on the confirmation to see what is the protocol and how should I go about quarantining myself from the Ministry of Health. So until then, uh, talk to all my friends and tell them that they're going to come in contact with me just to be safe, quarantined by yourself and just to take it easy. And just to make people know, be safe over there, all right? Cool. Funny thing is, he just had a birthday recently, um, within the past, I would say the past seven days or so, and he was at a party in Jamaica and having fun as people do, but no one was exercising um, any sort of uh, safety protocols in relates to COVID-19. You know, simple mask would suffice at this point. Um, no one had those masks on, so. I'm just making this video to say that if, a, if an individual like Usain Bolt can be um, contracting this thing, um, what chance do you have? Now, the likelihood of anything happening to him, I'm assuming, I'm not a doctor, but I'm assuming it's slim to none, right? Um, but at the same time, you and I are, are average folks moving around, um, our health is not as the at the standard of a world-class athlete, right? I think it's safe to say. So we still have to be uh, cautious in our interactions, um, in traveling around if we have to, because again, this thing is still out there um, and it's still affecting folks, it's still affecting lives. And I would hate to be one of those lives or anyone for me. Um, I wouldn't want any of them to be at risk. So, just, you know, take this as, take it for what it is. Um, if you have to go out, bring a mask, wear a mask, right? Wash your hands, right? Limit uh, your interaction with other folks as it relates to touching and these things right because this thing is real this thing is there that's all guys just be safe out there um you know follow the advice of usain bolt quarantine yourself if you believe that you might have contracted it or if you know based on your test results that you have it just do 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 what the world health organization or your respective governments um, are suggesting that you do you know think about it may not affect you personally but you can pass it on to someone that is in ill health and then that would be bad for that person too thank you for watching ready t plus please like share subscribe um i put out array of videos on different things uh, one thing you can be sure of that you could learn something you'll be entertained uh, from my channel here on ready t plus all right and with that see you in the next video peace <laughs>